in both countries. Away from that, the National Judicial Council has recommended 11 justices of the Court of Appeal for elevation to the Supreme Court bench. A statement by the Apex Court Director of Information, Sojo on Wednesday evening, said the recommendation was made at the 104th meeting of the Council in Abuja. The recommended candidates will be sworn in after the approval of the recommendation by President Bola Tinobu and the subsequent confirmation of the appointment by the Senate. With this appointment, the Apex Court will have the full complement of 21 justices as envisaged by the Constitution. Those recommended for appointment to the Supreme Court are Justice Jumai Sanki, Justice Chidi Ibiriwa, Justice Haruna Samani, Justice Mo A. Adume, Justice Obande Obunya, Justice Stephen Ada, Justice Habib O. Abiru, Justice Jamilu Chukur, Justice Abubaka Omar, and Justice Muhammad Idris. TVC News Judiciary Correspondent Celestina Ria joins us now for more. Celestina, walk us through the significance of this and the process involved. Yes, about today, as you rightly mentioned, the number of justices will now be tweeted and confirmed by the Senate. And this is in line with Section 23, Subsection 1 of the 230, I beg your pardon, Subsection 1 of the Constitution which says that there will be a Supreme Court, there will be a Chief Justice, and also 21 Justices of the Supreme Court. This will likely be the first time we'll be having the complete number in the bench. And also, uh, if you look at Section 231, it says that uh, the NJC will recommend the President will appoint, and the Senate will also confirm. So it's a process. And uh, in June this year, that... Uh, there's, there's vacancies on the bench of the Supreme Court. And when this is done, interested justices of the appellate court, from justices and also other judicial officers to the Federal Judicial Service Commission, who will screen this, screen them and did, do some tests and send their, the list to the Supreme Court or the NJC, I beg your pardon. But if they, they have 11 vacancies, the uh, Federal Judicial Service Commission will send double the number. Uh, sometime about two weeks ago, we saw some list, a list uh, going around, uh, having names of justices who were going to be appointed uh, to the Supreme Court. We had priority and reserved, and it's done to ensure that the six political zone is represented. Currently, the Supreme Court has uh, 10 justices. Initially, it was 13. Uh, unfortunately, uh, they lost Justice Santos Uweze, Justice Amina Auge retired, and Justice Mohamed Datijo also retired. So they were left with a 10. So now with this, uh, if this 11 scale true, although we haven't had a time where the president, not even captured in the constitution, if a situation arise where the president don't appoint the number of justices being sent to him by the NJC. But if this 11 scale true, so we'll have uh, 21 uh, justices at the bench. Right, and so also, this leaves a gap at the penultimate court, which we also call. All right, Celestina, so we thank you for that update. Thank you.